In three, two, all engines go. Hey, I'm vlogging here. So I just had breakfast with the talented and amazingly handsome David Archuleta. Dude, that's a, that's a, so crazy. Here's a life lesson. Uh, I'm sure you want to hear another one of Shea Carl's life lessons, don't you? David Archuleta, winner of American Idol. The kid can sing. If you don't know who David Archuleta is, just look him up on the internet and a million things will come up. He just got back from a two-year mission for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. He was a missionary in uh, Chile, Chile and uh, just got home, he's been home for two weeks, and I just saw somehow randomly on Facebook there was a video that said, uh, you know, American Idol season winner David Archuleta comes home from his church mission. And I was like, oh, that's cool. I'm like, I wonder what he's gonna do now, you know? Because he had all this press, all this crazy stuff happening, and then he decided to go on a mission. He won American Idol, had all these opportunities pop up, and instead of like going down the route of like signing with a record label and doing all this stuff, he serves a two-year service mission. One, I'm like, dude, that guy is awesome. I mean, to sacrifice what is obviously on his way to being becoming a very lucrative musician, he decides to serve a mission. I'm like, I like this guy. I like this guy. So I saw that he came home and then I like, I'm like, I wonder if he has a Twitter. So I go follow him on Twitter. I see the other night he posted some picture with him and a banjo and I, it comes to my mind again. I'm like, what is he gonna do, man? Is he gonna just like, is he gonna sign with a big record label or like, what is his plans? So I thought, because in my mind, I'm like, I don't want him to do that. Not like I have like an agenda or I care what he does, but I'm just like, he could, with YouTube and the way that social media is now, he can own all of his own stuff. Like he can do whatever he wants and have the freedom and creativity of not having a label tell you what to do. And so I just randomly tweet him. I'm like, I'm just gonna tell him that. I think he wants to hear my advice because why not? I'm Shea Carl. <laughs> so I just decided to tweet him that. So I tweeted him, hey man, I can't remember what I said. Welcome home, uh, don't sign with a record label, you should start a YouTube channel. So then he tweets me back. I was walking to the, I was going to the gym and he's like, hey Shay, well if I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna need your advice. And I'm like, what, David Archuleta just tweeted me? Because when I was a radio DJ, is right when he was winning American Idol. So in my mind, David Archuleta is huge because I was a radio DJ, American Idol was huge at the time and it still is. And so I'm like, dude, this, dude who just won one of the biggest music shows in the world just tweeted me and I was like, what? Anyways, his manager tweets me and she's like, hey, let's meet for breakfast and we'll just chat. So I just had breakfast with David Archuleta. Look at my picture on Instagram. That's proof. Anyways, cool kid, man. He, that guy, he's gonna go far. So we just talked. It wasn't like, you know, we signed, you know, I don't care what he does, but I just told him, I said, man, you can like own your own stuff. You can create your own stuff. YouTube is great for that. So I don't know what he's gonna do, but we just had breakfast and he's a cool guy. And mostly we just talked about like our missions. We shared like old mission stories and you know what it's like being back. I remember when I came back, I was afraid of girls. Cause you know, when you're on your mission, you don't date, you don't like touch girls. You like, you shake their hand. So like I told him, I was like, so when are you gonna get married and start having kids? He's like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, it was cool. Cool guy. You should guys go follow him. He's gonna start doing YouTube videos, hopefully. I told him he needs to. I told him it'd be great if him and uh, Princess Tart and Baby Tart sang a song together. I don't know. Anyways, okay, I'm headed home right now to go see my wife and give her kisser on a big delicious lips. What are you doing, you cutie pants? <laughs> oh, you eating dinner? <laughs> are you cooking yourself some mac and cheese? Yeah, I know. Where's your apron? You have a little apron that says something about. I know, I got one. Go. You know, I got one. But right now, we got a Lego. Lego. I got a Lego. Mm -hmm. That stuff over there is for a fun thing I'm doing on my channel. You guys will have to check it out. I think it's going up on the 23rd of April. So, yeah. I went shine it. 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 That was weird. It's mac and cheese time. <laughs> okay, we gotta get the butter out. Hold on. No, don't put too much of that in, then it'll taste bad. Mm -hmm. Need some butter and some milk. Why are you stirring that? Why are you using this to stir? Because someone stirred it. Because <laughs> someone stirred it. Here's the butter. Thank you. Oh. What, did, what did you tell me earlier why you're using that to stir? Stir it. No, why did why did you use this though? Because I won't stir. 
No, who used it before? In the movie. What movie did he use it on? Mr. Peabody? Mr. Peabody? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Um, okay, so what's next? Milk. Milk, you wanna do it? Yep. Okay, you do it. Okay. Now my milk. Be careful, the pan's hot, remember? These are my milk. You like to do this all by yourself, don't you? Oh, that's good. Good job. Yep. Just a little bit, huh? Yep. Okay, what's next? What's next? Cheese. No, my cheese. But don't stir. Don't stir? Well, we have to stir it so that it gets all no, mushed together. Try this one. Oh, you want me to use this one? Yeah. Okay. All right, Mr. Chef, are you ready? Yep. Don't stir. You want to stir? Yep. Hey, Mom, come hold this. You are cute. Mom, come hold this. Oh, I gotta hold this. I gotta hold this. Good job, dude. Do you know your cutest buttons? Yeah! Yeah, I do. All right, action on the hot chick walking down the stairs. Take one, go. Look, I can even run down the stairs. Okay, you guys, so mommy and the girls are actually headed out right now to go do yeah. a shoot. I it's a brand are. deal for, I can, can I say? Yeah. When's it yeah. coming out? Sit over here, sit over here. On the 23rd of April, I think. So mommy Tarp, everything goes not only does she do everything around the house, now she's making the dollar dollar <laughs> bills, y'all. She got a brand deal with Crocs shoes, and she's wearing Crocs right now. This is one I was kind of excited about because I actually do like them. I used to always think of Crocs as like lame shoes that nerds wore. But those oh, are pretty cool. And look, I like Princess Tar, are these yours? Mm -hmm. These are your Crocs? Dude, that's yeah, awesome. Wait, wait till you see the other ones that All right. I Suntard got some. They sent us a bunch of them. That's awesome. I don't go in the back. Okay, jump on. Ready? Jump on. One, two, three, jump. Oh, yeah. You guys, we're going over to the beach. So me and the boys are going to the beach. Beach. Are we going to go Dad swimming? We're going boogie boarding. The beach. What? And Buck are going to go to the beach, okay? Can Suntard, can Suntard come? Yeah, he's going to come too. Okay, looks looks like you got invited. Okay. High, high five. five. Brother, high five. Brothers don't hug. Wait, switch it. Brothers don't high five, brothers hug. Well, while mom's out doing her shoot, I thought we might as well just take a stroll on down to the beautiful Pacific coast and dip our feet in that beautiful sand. Oh, a hyperdemic needle, hyperdemic needle. What are you playing, dude? You got your jet? Yep, I can build a sandcastle. Do you want to build a sandcastle? So I can throw some sand in your eye. Come out of your stupid room. You frozen girl will kick you in the thigh. And then a shark will bite you if you don't come out and play. I like building sandcastles. Seagull chaser. <laughs> He's getting all the seagulls. Seagulls everywhere. Get him, dude. Don't give up. You'll catch one. He's chasing that one. That couple right there is smoking a joint. Rock hard, don't smoke any of their drugs, okay? Get that seagull, though. All right, we built ourselves an aircraft carrier. There's only one F-16 in our fleet, but it's ready to take off anytime. Just give us the word, General. Take the jet. Take the, hold the jet. You want me to take the jet off? Yep. Okay, ready? Here we go. In three, two, all engines go. <laughs> all right, you gonna get out? You done? No. You like it? Yeah, I don't stay in here. Tell him what you said you look like. I don't stay in here. He said, I look like a mermaid. I look like a mermaid. Are you a mermaid? Yep. You're the prettiest mermaid on the beach. Yep. Say, but daddy, I love him. I don't want to be a mermaid. I don't want to be a mermaid. Thingamabobs, I've got 20. I got 20. But who cares? But details. No big deal. That's what you say. I no want more. Deal. Yeah, that's Ariel, huh? You yeah. got it. You got my, my quote. <laughs> oh, I'm going to tickle you now. I'm going to tickle you now. <laughs> All right, you ready to finish this game? Yeah. Okay, what's the score? Two to one, Suntard's beating me at soccer. So we got water bottles and sandals set up as goals, 
and we're playing soccer. I beat him the first game 10 to 8. What was the first score? 10 to 8? Regardless, I won. But he's up right now, so I gotta go dominate him. Okay, guys, I'll see you later. All right, Suntard lost. He has to do the loser swim. The loser had to go get in the ocean, and it is not warm today. The sun is out, kind of, but it's kind of brisk out here. It's still beautiful, though. All right, so we're finished on the beach. We're gonna go home, get Mommy Tard and the girls, and I think we're gonna meet Casey. Casey was in Idaho, and he's just getting back in town tonight, and it's Gage's birthday. Hey, is today National Siblings Day? Is that today? I think it's today, dude. I think Gage's birthday is today. Maybe we should go get him something. Yeah. What should we get him? What do you think he wants? Well, he told me he wanted a soccer ball. A soccer ball? We can afford that. Let's go get a soccer get ball. Him, let's get him a cool one. Yeah, I don't want to get him a lamb soccer ball. Nobody likes lamb soccer balls, that's for sure. All right, we're going to get a present for Gage, and then we're going to go out to dinner with the whole family. I love it. All right, did you have a good time at the beach? Yeah. Is that awesome? All right, yeah. get in your truck. Climb up in your seat, surfer dude. <laughs> He's so cute in his little Iron Man swimming suit. Get in there. Got the surfboard, the boogie board in the back, soccer ball. Load up, boys. Got your honey made Angry Bird crackers. Excellent. I'll give him an official size. I'm get green ball, please. You want to get the green ball? Is that for you or Gage? We're getting one for Gage. It's his birthday. I think this is cool. You like that one? This is official size. You like that one? Let me see the color. You think he'll like that one? You like this one, Gavin? I don't know. Which one do you think we should get? That one or that one, Rock Tart? Yeah, I think for the zoo. The green one! <laughs> hey, let's get him a goal too. What if we get him one of these? Like a pop up goal, and then he can like actually kick it in the goal. Yes! Here, we're gonna get that for Gage, okay? For his birthday. Then he can kick it in the goal. Soccer ball and a goal. You like that green one better? Did Rockstar talk you into it or what? You're a good negotiator. It's a FIFA World Cup for Zilch. Please hold this. Okay. FIFA World Cup, that's the best. It's the one I have, but it's an orange. Anything else? Should we get him some cleats or something? I was going to Soccer say ball? I don't we don't know his it. size though. Oh, look, what about some, dude, get him some wristbands. He'll think those are cool. Yeah. Some wristbands? Yeah. Where you at? I should get this. No hula hoops. I should get this for me. Why should you get that for you? Because I want to get for me. <laughs> it was mine. <laughs> We're not getting you presents. It's not your birthday. We're only getting Gage presents. Is it pink? Okay. This one. Why can't he have pink, bro? I'm just saying. What? I thought you would pick a more cooler color. What? Pink's not cool? Well, I, in my opinion, I'm, I'm not a pink kind of guy. Why are you not a pink kind of guy? I don't know. What if there's guys out there that are into pink? Like this one. Good for them. <laughs> I'm just not one who likes pink. Good for them. Rockstar, go put the pink hula hoop back. We gotta go. Come on, we're just getting Gage a present. No, this is my we bought you Le Legos yesterday. You're not getting that. Hey, I'm serious. Go put it back. No, you're not getting it. I know. It's a very sad day. Tragedy. Hurry, go put it back. Let's go. <laughs> oh, he eats it. Rockhart actually does this really cute thing. Whenever he asks to get something, I tell him no. He goes, Oh, like he acts like he's like throwing a tantrum, but he doesn't throw a tantrum. He just pretends that he's throwing a tantrum. Let's see you throw your tantrum. Like, oh, I'm so mad. Oh, I'm so mad. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here, put it back. <laughs> good music. Oh, nice move, dude. Maybe we should buy that for you. That was good. One more time. One more time. Okay, give that to me. I'm putting it away. All right, come on, let's go. We're out of here. Okay, so that was a big day. I actually filmed a video for my channel and I used this camera so I didn't get very much Shay Tart's footage. I'm sorry guys, and my camera's about to die. Did you girls have fun with me? Yeah, it was so fun. <laughs> we had a girls day yeah. and- Winnie the Pooh had so much fun too. <laughs> Winnie the Pooh had fun too. And it was for a brand deal on my channel, so you guys will have to wait for that. I think it's coming out April 23rd is the, the tentative date, so I'll let you know. Now it's time to go home and see what the boys are up to. All right, Shaytards, assemble! What are you talking about? I said, yeah, there's more to see. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, hold on, let me just get a zoom real quick. Z inappropriate, Rock Tar. what are you thinking, bro? Come on. You're way hotter than that when you're lingerie. Oh, really? In your lingerie. Oh, when she wears her lingerie. Huh? Today after all kind of comes up the stairs. No, enough players. Go get your kid. Can't you keep track of your freaking kid? No. I just let him. He just, you know, he's gonna go shopping. He'll meet us, you know, wherever we're going. Come on, dude. We're meeting the other butlers for dinner. Look at him. Yay, 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 yay. 
Got Gage's present? Yep. All right, we got Gage's birthday present. I'm excited to see him and his reaction. Quit shopping, let's go. Where's Baby Tart? Oh, Has anybody seen Baby Tart? Oh, yeah. oh, she's right up there. Say hi, Baby Tart. Hi. Boom. At what? I looked weird until I pushed record. <laughs> Casey! Casey LeVere, Kaylee. Casey. <laughs> Kaylee. Baby, <laughs> 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 hey, go run and get him. Let's run and go grab him. Dooby dooby doo, dooby dooby doo. Oh, here they come. Dooby dooby. Hey, get your present. Oh, you're gonna put it right there? Okay, watch. Let's see this reaction. Gage is gonna come. He's gonna sit down on his seat, and the present is right there waiting for him. And when he gets there, he's gonna be like, Whoa, what's this? Is this mine? Is this for me? And we're like, Yeah, it's for you. And he's like, No way. Thanks, Gavin. You're the best cousin. Hey, Bray Bray. How's it going? How's your life? I like those earrings. Oh. Did you get your ears pierced? Did I you had her ears pierced for a oh, long time, honey. Hi. Hi. Did you just realize that I was pregnant You're too? Pregnant? <laughs> hey Gage, what's going on, dude? We have a seat for you already picked out. Okay? There's your seat right there. That's your seat, bro. Guess what's in the bag? Open it up, dude. It's for you. It's for your birthday. What do you think? Oh my goodness. What do you think, buddy? Thanks. Yeah. That was Suntard's idea. Thank you, Dad. Give him a big kiss on the lips. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Do you like it, dude? Yeah. Do you see the wristbands? There's wristbands, too. Show him the wristbands. Do you like it? Thank you. Cage, look at my camera and say thank you to the camera. <laughs> thank you, guys. Hey, Case. Hey, Casey. I've been wanting a soccer ball really bad, and I've kind of failed as a parent. <laughs> he said, Centaur got a new soccer ball. I wanted a soccer ball like a month ago. Did he? No, no, he's got one. What do you tell Shay and Colette? Thank you, guys. They always put us in this family room, which I really like. It's like this nice, They're like, oh, these guys are in the corner. Like, oh, oh, like, we're not in the family. <laughs> we're a herd of bunnies. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, you procreators. Yeah. Haley, can't you keep your... Okay, let's just cut the right there. I'm missing it! What are we missing? What if it's dead? Where are they? They're not, they just lay there. No, they just, the silk, the silk oh, on their cool. Yeah, if her, you have to leave it for a couple hours so the silk will blow. Uh, so like, the silk Do they will, all come out? Or just, no, just two. Just two. Just but we two have to put the water two. on it. So Dude, no, that's so exciting. Welcome to the world, butterfly. We're c very oh, proud of you. Oh, be careful. You came out of your larva, your cocoon. What they do? Them coming out. They built a body, a butterfly body. That's cool. Brochard's oh, very happy. happy for them. <laughs> I am excited for the arrival of the butterflies. They are my <laughs> friends and I will pet them. I love them. You guys know them? Their names are Bob and Jenny Sue. No. And I, I knew them before I came <laughs> here. Their names. Name is, um, oh, Rebecca, Rebecca, Samantha, oh, Scarlett, and Olivia. How many what? of them are there? There's four. What are you saying? Oh, okay. <laughs> He's so excited. You excited for the butterflies? Huh? Me? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I am. I was thinking about something else. Sorry, Dad. Mommy, can you, and when we're sleeping, can you, in our life, so we'll sleep, can you make some sugar water for it? Well, we should sure go make some right now. <laughs> you guys go to sleep. What? They drink sugar water? Yeah. Well, it's it's sugar. Sugar sugar and sugar wait, water. we feed them oranges and watermelon. That is so cool. What a cool life process, we can huh? Put watermelon in there. All right, brush teeth, get in bed. See you tomorrow, cutie face. I'm really happy to see them. We'll put sugar water, because sugar water won't go bad when we're gone. Dexter is really happy to see them. Water won't go bad when we're gone. Yeah. He's I'm so glad they have And it's Friday again. So today's a big day for us. We are trying to get this house cleaned, bags packed, and on a flight back to Idaho by 6 p.m. I got to get this vlog up, help Colette with the kids, get all the suitcases packed. So next week, when you guys come to hang out with us, Monday morning, we're going to be with my parents and my sister and my brother. Uh, Idaho vlogs are fun. We're going to do some fun stuff. We're going for spring break. The kids are off of school for a week, so we figured we'd all head on down to our kinfolk, down the mountains of Idaho, shoot some guns and drive some trucks, and yeehaw, grill up some fresh whiskey. Wait, no. Uh, nope, we're not alcoholics. We like to eat meat, though. 
stakes. Well, sparingly. <laughs> this is weird. All right. Love you. Check out yesterday's vlog. Click on that feeling lucky button and see what the Shadehards were doing one, two, three, four, and five years ago. Hey, I'm trying to hook you guys up with long vlogs, huh? I done pretty good, right? 20 minute vlogs, five days in a row. I know that we're off the weekends, but you know, it's like good. I think it's a good compromise. I love you guys. If you are sad, there are plenty of Shaytard moments to view. Over 1,900 of them. Okay? That marks 20 minutes. Love you guys. See you on Monday.